Hi, I've been asked to provide a little distinction between vacuum extraction assisted deliveries as well as forcep deliveries. Uh, the, the major distinction is the instruments that are used. Uh, the vacuum is a plastic cup that is applied to the leading edge of the, of the fetus uh, upon delivery and is maintained through a suction uh, to the scalp. The forceps, uh, as most know, are, are metal uh, instruments which are applied alongside the head, fetal head uh, and are used to provide additional traction uh, during uh, mom's pushing. The biggest distinction between the two is placement um, and the expertise in placement. It takes a little bit more expertise in applying forceps uh, and the head has to be in a proper position to apply forceps. Uh, the vacuum still needs to be applied appropriately, uh, but doesn't require uh, as much expertise. More often used in more emergent situations, perhaps the fetal heart rate is dropping and mom is close to delivery and the vacuum is a little easier to obtain, apply quickly and provide that little bit of extra traction that mom may need just to get the fetal head delivered. Forceps are generally going to be uh, applied when there's been uh, a stop of progression during pushing and there's a little bit more traction needed to deliver the head in, in a safe manner and but as I said it's usually a little bit more uh, requirement of expertise to apply the forceps under those circumstances. There can be a little bit more risk of trauma to mom in terms of some lacerations inside the vagina with forceps um, but if applied correctly then, then that should be minimized. Most of the difference really in today's world is the comfort of the physicians in terms of what they use. Uh, many of the younger physicians aren't uh, exposed to forceps as much as uh, the older generation because of various reasons. So they're not as comfortable with, with forceps compared to the vacuum.